Hey racers, John Racer for you today, back for the Hot Wheels 2019 G case. Decide your ride. Now, I unboxed this case last Thursday, so I think it's only fair we do the decide your ride and unboxing of it now. So, if you guys don't know how it works, all you gotta do is comment down below the name of the car you wanna win in next week's tournament, and if it wins, you will get a shout out at the end of the video. We have some fantastic cars to open up, so let's just jump in into it starting off with what i think one of the best cars in the case the 96 porsche carrera in white this thing is an absolute beauty it looks super clean i really love this casting out of the packaging with the nice colored interior i think it looks fantastic all right first car next up we've got the 67 chevelle ss 396 in red looking very sleek there I like it next up we've got a fantasy car we've got tur bone charged let's go ahead and unbox this guy he's got some huge weird wheels on it but it seems smooth he rolls pretty smooth maybe he'll be fast down the track I mean I guess we'll just have to find out next up we've got speed box in gold this is a recolor from the silver version that came earlier this year. The shiny gold cars I always like because I am a sucker for gold cars. That looks really good. Next up we have Buns of Steel. That is right, a cheeseburger car. Let's go ahead and crack this guy open. Metal base, he's relatively heavy. I don't know, he seems like he could be very quick down the track. But hey, there's only one way to find out. Next up, we've got the clean 88 Honda CRX. Now, if you guys have watched all of my tournaments, well, not even all of them, but I have raced the CRX in multiple tournaments of mine, and it is a very quick car. So I'm excited to see how quick this variation is with these wheels on it. But it seems fast and it looks slick. Let's see how it'll do. But we have a competitor, the Dodge Charger RT in blue. It's another Dodge Charger. They haven't released a Dodge Charger in a while, so I'm glad that they did, and it looks Pretty nice, I would say. Very cool. Now we've got the main line for the case, the 92 Ford Mustang. Now I decided I'm not gonna open the uh, super treasure hunt that we got in the case of the Mustang. I think it'd be fun to collect all of the super treasure hunts for this year and then do a video with them once I've collected them all. So this is just the main line. I won't be opening the super for this race, but uh, yeah, maybe that thing's quick. We don't never know. Next up, we've got a white too tough. This thing looks pretty tough, if you ask me. If it could get out of the blister, there we go. I always like too tough. This is a weak color of the red version. I think the white version looks a lot better with the red, white, and blue coloration on there. Looking nice. Next up, we have Exotique with sort of the matte tan color. Not many matte tan Hot Wheels, I could say, but it looks very clean and it feels very slick. Now, Exotic is not very, not a very fast casting from the casting that I got uh, a while back, but hey, maybe it, can, maybe it can surprise us. Next up, we've got the 49 Volkswagen Beetle Pickup in red. I think I like the red a lot more than the blue, but hey, that looks pretty, pretty clean. I interrupt this video to let you guys know about my second channel slash gaming channel if you want to call it that. On this channel I upload a whole bunch of stuff. I upload Forza videos which I know a lot of you guys like. I've even dipped my feet into some VR gaming and then I've even done a movie review. So if you guys want to help me and support this channel all you got to do is click that subscribe button and make sure you have the notifications on. It I would really appreciate it and I'll be doing some fun stuff with this channel in the future so go ahead. Click the link down below, subscribe to this channel, and I'll keep you guys updated on maybe some giveaways and fun stuff that we have in the future. So, thank you guys for subscribing. Now, back to your scheduled video. Next up, we have got the Fair Lady 2000 in yellow. Let's go ahead and open up this guy. Looks very nice. I love the yellow paint on that thing, and it's it just looks super low with a nice little wide body kit on it. And it just looks so clean. These cars are always fun to watch go down the track, so that is exciting. Next up we have the Spider-Mobile. It's like the Batmobile, only cooler because it is Spider-Man's little car. And that is awesome. 
Now, if you guys have watched any like Spider-Man movies, such as Into the Spider-Verse, this you see this car there, and it looks super cool. And I can't wait to see this race down the track because it feels relatively heavy, and hopefully it's pretty quick. So there's only one way to find out, and that's to race it. Next up, we have the Pagani Choir. This car is notoriously fast. Every single mo model that this has come out as has been fast. So Pagani Choir, one car to look out for, that is for sure, because this thing is quick on the wheels. Next up, we have Slide Kick. This thing has some moving parts, so we're just gonna have to experiment with this guy real quick. He rolls on the ground, feels pretty quick. Look at that, you can pull out the rear tail and then out comes the little, the little guy because I don't think you can see, there's no windshield on here. So that's pretty cool. Nice little neat moving part there. Interesting, maybe it's fast, maybe it's not. I mean, there's only one way to find out. Now we have Tricero truck. I do not know if I've raced this coloration of the Tricero truck already. I think I raced a blue one before, but I don't know if I've raced the red one, but if I have, please don't get upset with me. I guess it's just another run for glory for the Tricero truck, the absolute unit of a Hot Wheel. Next up, we've got a fast Hot Wheel just in general. We have Carbide. This thing was built for speed. It's got a metal base. It's super light. It's very low to the ground. This thing is gonna be something to look out for in the tournament. Now, Next up, we've got our, our Roadster, or Roadster, whoever you want to pronounce it, with the black and blue paint scheme. It looks super clean. I love the wheel choice on that car. It looks very nice. Next up, we have Blastrous Moto. This thing will actually go down the track because it is three-wheeled. So this will be one of the first motorcycles we have in this race. And I don't know, motorcycles are never fast, but uh, I could be wrong with this one. You never know. All right, three more cars remaining. We got the Dark Knight Batmobile in blue with the big tires in the back. Uh, I don't think I've ever owned one of these. I've seen them a lot in the store, uh, but I don't know how fast they are. So it'll be interesting to see how that guy compares to the other cars in this race. Next up, we got a 66 Chevy Nova in red with flames. I mean, it has flames on it, which automatically adds at least 200 horsepower to the car. So it looks very, very clean and very good. All right, for our final car that you guys get to choose from, the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR police car. These, this thing is fast. If you guys watched Hot Wheels Tournament Season 5, this thing made it up to, I believe, the finals for Nissan, because it's a very quick car, but we're gonna have to see how the new variation does on the track. So there you have it, guys. Those are the cars you can choose for the tournament. Turn tournament? Term tournament? Tournament. Comment down below what car you want to see win. And then if your car wins, you'll get a shout-out at the end of the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take it easy. Peace.